my gosh. Oh my gosh. We are getting some snow up in Big Bear Lake. I'm so excited. I'm so excited and I'm feeling a lot better, you guys. Holy moly. The blood pressure medication um, and the anti-anxiety stuff, like I'm, I'm almost feeling normal right now. Knock on wood, knock on wood. But yeah, we're getting some snow. Sorry, I just get a little Tourette syndrome there when I get excited. Um, <laughs> this is, oh my God, I can't believe this. I am so excited. I am so excited. Hey, I just met one of you guys too. I was doing some work and uh, I, I met up with this person and uh, he recognized me and I was like, no way, dude, like no way. So yeah, um, yeah, but we're getting snow right now. Holy moly. Talk about an adrenaline rush. I fell asleep. <coughs> Had to go back to do a couple more tests and stuff and so I, I went home and fell asleep really quickly. Yeah, hey, hang on, we're just gonna pull in here just for a second. I will turn it back on in just a moment, guys, hang on. Hang on. All right, guys, holy snowfall. Holy freaking snowfall, guys. I can't believe it, my friend. Yeah, so we're gonna cruise over here. Uh, you know what, we're not gonna take the back streets, forget it, we're gonna take the main streets so you guys can see what it's like. I feel like an idiot for doing what I just did, but uh, par for the chorus for me. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, so we are finally getting some snow. Ah, as I said, I was just I was just taking a nap, but I made sure it was every 20 minutes that it was waking me up just to make sure that we are good to go here. There's a cop right there, so I don't want to hold the phone up as much. And is he turning around? I hope not. I'm just trying to show people the weather, jeez. Alright, um, yes, so we are on Big Bear Boulevard, you guys, right now. It's uh, 36 degrees. And as I said, we are getting snow. gonna do a drive through the village and then up top of the village real quick just so you guys can see that part of town because I know that's a, a big spot a lot of people love to go visit and obviously this guy would pull out in front of me wouldn't he man I wanted to blast my train horn but he got out of the way Okay, so wait, is it turning back to rain right now? What in the heck is going on? No, it's still it's still light and snow, but there's rain now involved with it. Unbelievable. Well, I know how to fix that. Once we get through the village, we'll be heading back the other direction, and we're gonna drive back at a little bit higher elevation. We're gonna take some of the back streets, because it's not much elevation difference. We're on the snow line right now. So, literally, we are right on the snow line. Oh snap. All right, let's do this. Usually I would go past this light and make the first left just to avoid all the traffic in the village, but our whole point of this journey is to go into the village on the main drag. Okay, snow's coming down again. We just went through like a 10 second period of rain, you guys. How cool is that? Literally, we are on that snow line. <laughs> Jeez Louise. So tired, but so much energy right now. It's, I, I don't, I, I know that's an oxymoron, but it's, it's the truth. It's actual. Everything is satisfactual. You know? Zippity doo dah. Zippity a. My oh my, what a snowy day. Not a lot of sunshine coming our way. Zippity doo dah, zippity. -yay. <laughs> Seriously, I get so weird when it snows. I, I just don't get it, but it's all right. At least I'm alive to do this. Holy crap! Do you guys know something crazy? They said that I that I would have had a stroke if I didn't go in. 
<laughs> the reason I wasn't going into the hospital is because I didn't have any insurance. And thank God people were pushing me to go. Thank God. They said, yeah, if you would have stayed like that another day, maybe, it, it, we don't want to know what may have happened. So, yeah, enough about that, guys. Took my first blood pressure medication today and my first anxiety medication. And I think I'm good to go. I think I'm good to go. And I am excited. I am excited. So what we're going to do is we're going to drive through the village and then we're going to kind of go back to the Moon Ridge area through the back streets. Because they are at a little higher elevation, even though it's just a couple of feet difference, maybe like 50 feet, 100 feet difference right now. It's making a difference, believe it or not. So here is the Big Bear Village, folks. There's Jack in the Crack. Love Jack in the Crack. Um, we've got, we, there's a lot of good restaurants in here, you guys, in the village, but this is the main tourist drag. This is the tourist part of town besides the ski resorts. And then we got, yeah, I know you're trying to get over. I'm going to have to pass you up real quick. Madame, Madame, Jean-Claude, Madame. All right. And guys, for next storm, guess what I'm doing? I rented a really big hotel room the biggest at black forest lodge from sunday through wednesday so i can be there for the storm i'm gonna do the time lapse there and the time lapse at my house too and i'll well uh maybe not because that'll be like 15 minutes worth of time lapses but it'll be two different perspectives you know what maybe i'll do it anyway maybe i'll do it anyway <coughs> anyway we're not going through the end of the village we're cutting through here because your boy knows where he's going believe it or not I'm not as dumb as I look. I'm really not. I mean, look at this. I mean, when you see this, all you see is just dumb, right? But I don't blame you. I mean, that's, that's what I see too. You know, I spy with my little eye. Dumb. Uh, so I think, uh, yeah. I'm gonna try and get a little smarter though on the way back, I promise. Oh my gosh, seriously. I don't know if like, I'm like feeling a little bit weird from the anti-anxiety medication. Not a bad feeling, just like really calm. Like, whoa, we're going for a drive. Don't worry guys, if I felt like I was not safe, I wouldn't drive. I'm not, I'm not feeling like inebriated or nothing like that, but it's just an interesting feeling. I just feel mellow. I feel mellow. All right, so hang on just a quick second. I'm gonna pull over here for a second. I'm gonna answer this, this call and then I'll get the, the video going again. Hang on. Whoop, whoop. Here's the middle school, or no, elementary school, I'm sorry. Hang on. All right, cool. So yeah, we just passed the elementary school and we're taking this street called Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania kind of dead ends into, uh, well, not, not dead ends, but it, it, it turns into to one of the main drags in the village. If you keep on following it the other way. Oh man. And on this day, when, but I'm just not, feel oh, I got my snow tires on too, uh, two days ago. But yeah, if I wasn't feeling so freaking tired, I wouldn't mind all this work that is calling me right now. I got a lot of work to do, but that's, the cool thing is, is that my work is also driving so I can, I can do the videos while I'm headed to work. How cool is that? So, that's what we're doing. But I just wanted to give you guys a, kind of a, a quick update on what's going on right now. And then, obviously, as it picks up, I will be updating even more. And I'm excited about that. Next week's weather, that's what I'm super anticipatory for. I'm anticipating that big time. Monday and Tuesday. But so far, this is the most snow already that I've recorded this season, like real snow. So 
that's pretty cool. Okay, these roads are pretty easy to follow. Since we're on Pennsylvania, it says not a through street. Turn left here. And basically this is, this is kind of gonna take you to avoid all the traffic, you guys. Oh, unfortunately, some of my local friends do not like that I give you guys these directions, but I couldn't care what they think because you guys are the ones who spend money up here and you guys are the ones who allow us to live here. So as far as I'm concerned, all it is is that, 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 that. I'll tell you guys all the shortcuts. As a matter of fact, like I'll try to make you guys even more shortcuts. Um, because I don't care what they think like it, it's so weird people forget that without you guys none of us get to live here so um, yeah you guys are everything to me I don't want you guys wasting your time up here shortcuts are important for you guys so I hope you understand where I'm coming from all right now we're on Brownie Lane and Brownie Lane will take us to Moon Ridge Road which is where we are headed. Well, there's snow. I try not to go nearly as fast on, on these roads because of obviously kids wanting to play, but there's no snow to go sledding, so. But still, just being outside in the snow and catching snowflakes with your tongue, just super fun when you're young, I guess. It was for me. Maybe I'm just weird. Well, I mean, that's obvious, but. I always point this house out that's a fighter training camp Triple G used to live there and train there and a bunch of other fighters so that's pretty close right down the street from my house Up here, you got a lot of fighters. A lot, of, a lot of fighters. I love that scene, though. I love that scene. Hey, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Look, there's blue skies above us. How funny is that? And it's snowing. 35 degrees now, went down a degree. That is so cool looking though. And then whoop, over here to the left, over the lake, it's just, it's so socked in over there. So excited. So excited. All right, guys. December 9, 2021. I'll get back to you guys shortly with another video, I promise. I just don't want to inundate you guys with crazy long videos when we're going to be doing quite a few today.